Well, bam! Hmm. Sup, 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 y'all. Cards in the house again. Yo. As I told you before, I will be doing my next Dread Journey in my Static Shock costume. And I understand I'm not quite Static Shock esque. However, I will be so very soon. But before I get into that, I gotta tell you a little quick story in regards to Static Shock. This is crazy. This is unbelievable. Unrighteous. Uncanny. This is ridiculous. Okay, so basically, my roommate, my brother, my bro, my main man, Byron. He's actually been featured in some of my other videos. If you haven't seen some of my challenge videos, you need to get up on that because you'll know who this guy is. Basically, I'm talking to him about Static Shock, right? And I'm like, yeah, I think I want to be Static Shock for cosplay, you know, for the big Comic-Con, Amazicon. I'm excited! This is gonna be dope! And he's like, oh man, that's, that's great, man! Who's Static Shock? I'm looking at this guy and I'm like, are you serious? You don't know who Static Shock is? Man, I had to put him in his place. I had to give him the one, two, the left, right, good night. I had to teach him a lesson. It was bad. What do you mean you don't know who Static Shock is? I'm just saying, man, I don't know who he is. I never grew up watching the show before, all right? And this is usually how I handle my people. Man, I told you already, right? I didn't know who it was, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so after that, he never came up to me again. I ain't bleeding him. Cause keeps it real. I run these streets. Feel me? <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm scared. I don't. I don't. I don't like to fight. I prefer to. I prefer to use my heart instead of my fists. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I should probably get down to business. Are you guys ready for Static Shock? Y'all ready for Static Shock? I'm about to bring you Static Shock. Let's go. Dog, you told him. He did tell y'all. I wasn't playing with y'all. See, you may have not taken the car serious, but you gonna take Static Shock serious. You gonna take him real serious. To anybody out there who doesn't believe me or didn't take me serious, <laughs> you don't know who Static Shock is? <laughs> What's up? But you ain't even ready, man. I'll sneak attack your lips. See, see, what I do sometimes is you gotta hit them with combos, man. I got this one combo called the uh, blind them and mute them. See, here's what you do. So you get them real close, right? And you get them right in their eyes like this, like, ah, ah I can't see, oh. And then right when they're distracted with that, <laughs> right in the throat. <laughs> so they're gonna end up looking like this, I can't see, ow. You done messed up, you done messed up. You should always know who Static Shock is. Mm, with pride. Yeah, who am I? You static shot. Who am I? You static shot. Who am I? You static shot, though. Who's this right here? That's static shot. We love static shot. We miss him. I'm right here, baby. Right here. The cool thing about this guy is he's a dreadhead. I'm telling you, man. There's so many things you begin to realize about dreadlocks. As hey, I done ripped these gloves up. Oh, oh my goodness. I knew I felt a breeze. Well, well, it needs them anyway. So the important thing is, is dreadheads, yo, it's beautiful out there. There's things you just notice when you have dreadlocks. You're like, like when you're thinking about cosplay, I've never been in one of those things in my life where you're dressing up, you're going to a Comic Con. I'm like, who am I gonna be? What superheroes have dreads? Then you start realizing that there's all these really cool superheroes that have dreadlocks. You start, people can appreciate it. People appreciate the look. People are like, dude, this is perfect. You got the hair, everything is set up, but I mean, beyond all the cool compliments and all that cool stuff that happened, I met some really cool kids that were there. Two twin brothers and both of them had dreadlocks and they were with their mom. They had dreads, they were probably like four or five years old, man, and they are representing. And 
So it's always cool to see other dreadheads out there. Yo, shout out to all the dreadheads out there, all you guys on YouTube, all you guys out there rocking them, being extra hot, having to sport them anyway. I got mad respect for that. That's dope. Do what you do. Okay, I gotta lose this cape, I'm dying. But besides all that, I've had a couple new development with the dreads. It's really dope. Um, you know, like I was saying in my last video, sometimes I'm kind of hang on my face and that can get really irritating. Like, I don't know about you guys, but sometimes I'll be breaking out bumps and stuff. I'm like, man, I can't be doing this. How am I supposed to get jiggy with this? I can't get jiggy with this. Okay, so sometimes what I use, there's three things. You can use bobby pins like these. I use a lot of them, so that's why a whole bunch of them are missing. Uh, you can also use these. I I've shown you this in my last video, like the headbands. Okay, and then this one, this is probably the one <laughs> that gives the most unique look. I've gotten bashed for this one, but I don't care. Like, I do me. You know what I'm saying? If you don't know that, find out cost does him. And you know what? Have you guys that got dreads out there? I know you're doing you too. A lot of the beauty about dreads is that you do what you want. You do your own style. Some people knock them. As I said in my other videos, some people always have opinions and stuff like that. But you, it's a process. It gets better and better the longer they get. And I can actually attest to that. Like, if I go back and I look at my old videos, like, I look at my old videos and I'm like, my hair was that short at one point? You know what I mean? Some of you guys may know exactly what I'm talking about. Like, you go back and you look and you're like, that was me? Like, oh. And then you see all the length, you see the growth. And that's what's so dope about doing these dread journeys because you can always play it back, you can always look, and you can see your own progress. It's really cool. It's a journey and I'm sharing it with y'all. So come on, grab your backpacks, yo, get your lanterns, get your, get your s'mores, and let's get on this journey. Let's go. Like I'll take this. You know, like you can get this, you can get this at a little drugstore. You know, you know, you know, you know, you know. And then, you know, I got, I got a little, I got a little pineapple action going. And I'm gonna tell you, I've gotten the most mixed thoughts on this. A little uneven. But whatever, I don't have time to perfect it. But I've had some people that have said, oh, that's so tight, or like, that looks so cool, or that's unique. And then I've had people that are like, stop, take it, it's ugly, take it down. <laughs> okay, so these are pretty dope. Um, but you know, some people may see a bobby pin in your hair, they're like, why, why you have bobby pin in this? That's for girls. I'm like, man, that's for long hair, homie. Don't be judged. So you see how it's kind of holding this part back? It's not falling in my face anymore. You know, mad convenient. I'm just super grateful for you guys on YouTube. Like, I've been trying to, I've been trying to make a practice to go to other people's channels more and more often and comment and like and subscribe. Honestly, feel free to leave comments. Like, I try to keep my videos really fun. I try to keep them entertaining, keep them really loose. I want you guys to be able to enjoy yourselves, man. I want you guys coming to just see another dread video or somebody talking about their own hair. Like, it's it's not all just about that. We're all, all of us are supposed to connect with each other. All of us got different stories. All of us got different journeys. All of us have things that go great with our dreads, and all of us have things that, you know, they may not go so great, but that's okay, we still taking it in and we still trying to make it work. If you get an opportunity, this isn't me trying to force you to do, you know, just be all about my channel. I'll get on yours too. But besides my dread journeys, I also do challenge videos. All love. But with all that being said, horses out, son. Huh? House, son.